If you're looking to boost your Mutt team or make some money by selling coins, check out MobileMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden 16 Ultimate Team video. Guys, today we've got brand new packs in the game. We've got a new 4th of July promo as well. Stars and Stripes packs in the game. And guys, as well, we do have a new Mutt Rewards as well. So, uh, everyone that's elite tier, I think it is, right? Or is it all mad i don't know what the hell it is whatever the top tier is on mutt rewards and if you guys haven't set up your mutt rewards yet make sure that you do that go over to the mutt rewards website sign up on there because you do get free packs in the game and you also get signed up for other free stuff that they give away throughout the year as well so uh guys right now you do actually get two free mutt rewards stars packs so these are uh, uh actually pretty good packs you get the two of the stars and stripes packs that are going for seventy thousand coins right now now, within the uh, the promo, there's a whole bunch of different collectibles and things like that, but you can actually pull these cards out of packs as well, so that's actually a, kind of a different thing than what they've had recently, so I definitely appreciate that. I, I feel like there's been a lot of sets this year and, uh, and collectibles and things like that, but there haven't been a lot of times when the good cards were actually able to be pulled out of packs, other than like the Boss Legend weekends, the Golden Ticket weekends, things like that, uh, but we do also have new movers cards in the game as well today, so so a lot of really good stuff to be able to be pulled we can pull four of these packs with coins as well so we're gonna do that and then we're also gonna pull the free two that we have as well so we've got a good opportunity here today to pull some really good stuff we're gonna try and do it uh, see what happens for us today uh, one other thing that I want to point out today guys before I get into the pack opening video is I am hearing some rumors right now from people and there's no credibility to this at all other than what I see on the Mutthead website so I'm gonna pop up that on the screen right now uh, you guys will see right now kind of what I'm talking about here so this is the lawyer Malloy card the 85 overall now I haven't seen this card anywhere it doesn't appear that it's actually on the auction block or anything like that yet uh, but if you guys didn't see there's a 99 lawyer Malloy that came out that's a beast of course uh, but there's also a 4th of July year over year reward edition of this card that's 85 overall now 85 overall at this point in Madden is garbage like it's not useful at all of course we all know that but the thing is, is that this is saying 4th of July year over year reward edition. Now, what I think is a possibility here, and what I've heard from other people as well, is that this card may be a card that you can pull into Madden 17 Ultimate Team. So, if you have this card on your roster, you might be able to use him at the beginning of Madden 17 when 85 overall is actually pretty good. And if you take a look at the attributes of this card, it's pretty damn nice for an 85 overall. It does lack some of the things like the catching attributes that you would look for. The zone coverage is mediocre, the man coverage is mediocre, but he has great hit power, great speed, great acceleration, really nice jumping. I mean, again, for an 85 overall card, this is a beast of a card. So this is definitely a card that you could build your team around to start the season next year. Uh, something to look out for anyway. I don't, again, I don't know if there's any sort of reports so far on this thing being a, a card for sure that you'll be able to pull in Madden 17 or pull over into Madden 17. But if you can, it's definitely something to take a look at. So keep that in mind, guys. Might be the first card that we get next year in Madden 17. So kind of a cool thing. Anyways, with that being said, Let's go in here, guys, and open up some of these Stars and Stripes packs. Cool card art on these, by the way. Actually, pretty nice card arts. Uh, again, big shout out to Pixel Pusher, who has done a great job this year with the content, uh, making it look pretty and everything like that. So, uh, definitely love this one. Stars and Stripes pack. 70,000 coins. You get five gold or better items, three silver or better items, and then four team items. And I think you also get a guaranteed collectible, too, if I remember correctly. But, anyways, let's go in here and open this thing up and see what we can get. Let's go, baby. Come on, son. Let's do this. We get our first gold, which is Reggie Nelson. A Connor Barwin. We get a 97 Jared Cook movers card. Let's go, baby. That is a beast card, dude. This might be my new starting tight end. 95 speed, 6 foot 5, 92 route running. Excellent release, excellent spec catch. Catching traffic is okay at a 91. That's a little bit lower than what I would look for. But, dude, that is a beast of a card. Definitely love pulling that. Let's go. And we get our Browns fireworks. Okay. 
I don't think that the teams actually matter that much. We get another movers card here. Raheem Moore, 93 overall. This one's not spectacular. And I'm actually pretty stacked at free safety. So I doubt that he's going to actually uh, do much for me. But decent pulls here. Two movers cards. Definitely like to see that. So uh, let's see here what else we can get in this pack. Probably not a whole lot. We get another Seahawks fireworks collectible, though. Uh, again, I don't think that the teams actually matter for this. I think it's just NFC and AFC, if I remember correctly. So uh, you just collect all of... You think you need, like, 15 of them or something like that, if I remember correctly? So uh, actually a pretty solid pack here to start it off. Not too shabby. Let's go! Oh, man. As soon as I saw that Elite to start it off, but it's a Sean Smith base Elite. Still pulling those base elites, but that's all right. Packers Fireworks Collectible. Manny Ramirez. We get a 94 Everson Griffin Final Edition. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Not a great card, but definitely decent. A Bengals Collectible there. So I wonder if we get two of these guaranteed per pack. We've gotten two of them every pack. So that's it's not bad. It's not bad. I mean, you can't do one of the sets with just the ones that you can get out of these packs. So that's a little bit unfortunate, but that's all right. You can still buy more of them. So let's go here. Third pack. We can do this, man. I know we can pull something amazing. Now, Jared Cook's actually a nice pull. I, I really am happy about that one. Good enough to start on my team at this point. <clears throat> and we get another two collectibles there. This is kind of the garbage pack, though. Yeah, just a bunch of trash in this one other than the collectibles, unfortunately. So definitely a mediocre pack there, but we've got some more here. We still got, I think, three more. We've got the free one and then one more that we can pull here with coins. So we'll try and do that. Come on. Give me a beast pull. One time. 98 Joe Hayden again. We get another one. Let's go, baby. Joe Hayden, I already have this card. This was probably the best pull that I had had in months and months and months in this game. So we get another one. Another Joe Hayden, again, starting cornerback for me already. So I'll probably be giving that one away or uh, or doing, you know, some sort of sale on it. I don't know. I haven't decided yet what I want to do regarding that. And we get our two collectibles here at the end. So, yeah, nice. Definitely like to see that. A campus hero. Uh, Joe Hayden, beast-ass card, man. 98 overall. Definitely like to see that. I can't believe we're still pulling these freaking NFL draft badges, by the way. That is crazy. All right, we've got two more here, guys. Two more Mutt Rewards Stars packs. Now, there's some sort of people. There's some people that think that the ones that you get, as far as your Mutt Rewards, are a little bit watered down. And then there's other people that think that you get really amazing ones. So let me know in the comments section below, guys. What do you think about that? Let's open these two free packs up and see what we can get. We'll make our determination after this. I don't know. So far, we've done pretty well. We've got a 98 overall pull, a 97 overall pull. We've got two collectibles in this one and a bunch of gold garbage. So. So far, not a good pack. Uh, the, the Mutt Rewards one has not done us well. But uh, we're going to get 12 total collectibles, it looks like. So uh, that'll at least get us close to doing an NFC and an AFC player. So maybe we'll do a video where we do one of each of those. Let's, we'll see. I don't know. But uh, we get, let's see here, a Madden NFL Live Adam Rank. I have no idea what this is. I haven't even heard about this set. So let me take a look at this. Add this special collectible to the Madden NFL Live set where you can earn a 92 overall Maurice Jones Drew running back. What? Why? First of all, why would I want a 92 overall? Is this thing super old or is it just like, I don't understand. Like, why the hell would I want a 92 overall Maurice Jones Drew at this point in the game? Okay, I don't get it. I, I'm confused, but all right, whatever. And we get absolute garbage out of this. I, I don't think this card is worth anything. So, two garbage-ass free packs, but you know what, though? Again, we do get the two collectibles out of each one, and they were free, so it is what it is on that. Um, anyway, guys, that is going to do it for this pack opening video today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. We did get two pretty nice pulls, so I'm happy about that. No 99 pulls, um, and none of the, the pulls as far as players go regarding the 4th of July promo, but still pretty decent. Could be a lot worse. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, though. If you did, do me a favor. Click that like button below. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I will talk to you guys again soon.